Thailand military declares coup two days after martial law imposed. Following the imposition of martial law on Tuesday, Thailand's army chief General Prayu Chan Ocha yesterday ousted the Thai government and declared a coup, saying its purpose was to calm the tensions in the country. On Thursday afternoon, a large number of soldiers blocked the entrance of the army club in Bangkok, where the army chief held a meeting with rival political factions for the second day. Reporters at the scene sensed the tension. I don't know because I'm, I'm not in the meeting room. So there's clearly some armed activity there. What are you doing? Is, there, is this a real coup now? Sorry, I, I, I don't know anything. One hour later, we all knew what actually happened. General Prayu Chan Ocha declared the coup on television, announcing that the military was dispensing with the caretaker government, suspending the constitution and seizing power. He imposed a nationwide curfew from 10 p.m. to 5 a.m. and said the coup was necessary to restore peace and order in the country. An informant told the Apple Daily that right after the caretaker government refused the general's proposal that he resign, he made his announcements on TV and had the leader of an anti-government faction, Sutep Thaksuban, and representatives from other political rivals sent to a military base. It is not yet clear whether they had been officially arrested. Anti-government protesters were peacefully bussed away by military from the Royal Plaza, while some protest leaders were detained. Hong Kong's government has raised its travel alerts for Thailand to red on Thursday.